<clears throat> positive thoughts in this system of things and NAM state. Um, I wanted to talk about <clears throat> that basically you being that you're not your circumstances and the law of assumption. Okay, so when I say what I mean by circumstances, it, you know, um, it does not matter when you're manifesting what you want and what it is you want and desire into your life. So, although we're in this 3D world, which is dense and uh, materialistic um, and low vibrational, it does not matter, okay? So, you know, I'm not saying that, you, you know, you don't want to jump out of a building and say, well, manifesting does not matter because it does in this 3D reality, you know, it, it, make, it makes no sense. So, however, when it comes to uh, manifesting the love and the, uh, and what it is that you desire, the money you desire, the financial wealth that you desire into your life, you know, health, happiness, love, all those things that everybody wants and what you deserve um, and what you depend on. And when it comes to that, regarding your sad circumstances, it does not matter, basically. So one of the primary principles that comes to manifesting is basically the principle of vibration. And since everything is basically energy in the universe, what I mean by that is that... Um, Basically, it's like it's like the timing and and tuning into a radio station being basically being on the right frequency and to and everything in the universe vibrates everything is in motion um, to all the contents in your home to um, everything basically is in constant motion and, um, you know, there's a quote that was made, you know, uh, uh, basically saying that you live in an ocean for motion. And that was from Bob Proctor. So that means that everything is moving, nothing is stagnant or still. And that means that Anything and everything is basically um, has the potential to change. So uh, relationships can change, uh, finances can change, your health can change, um, your career can change. Everything is fluid and, and is in motion in the universe, basically. So the Earth, earth is absolutely everything. Everything in the universe, everything in your life is an illustration of what you have been manifesting up until now. So I would need to hold that thought and think about that for a minute because what I'm trying to say is, is that everything you manifest is what you being the director, the writer and the script of your own play, basically, as a co-creator here. Um, so whatever you see in the 3D world is, or what has been, has been manifested up until now. But it has nothing to do with what will be manifested tomorrow, basically, or an hour from now, or a minute from now or a year from now. Um, so you have the potential to change your reality, to change your outcome by simply changing your beliefs and changing your beliefs meaning, you know, changes your vibration of energy basically in what it is you're manifesting. So your life at this moment, every moment, is by your thoughts and your feelings and your assumptions relate to that reality 
and that you detest the choice is yours. So you're not bothered basically about the 3D world. You don't worry about, about that. That's what I manifested yesterday. Um, but it has nothing to do with what I'm manifesting today in this present moment. So I'm going to continue with this in part two of the podcast. Um, so yeah, keep shining all. Um, stay positive thoughts in the system of thing, things and always show gratitude every day because it brings more goodies and more abundance from the universe. So see you in part two. Love and light. Bye for now. <laughs>